hello everyone today i will show you how to uh, pull the geo server image into the docker and use as a container and we will also see how to install the extension in a geo server docker geo server so let's get started first of all you may need a docker for desktop it will help you to visualize the images and the container and you can control the files and external commands in the container like if you go to the images whenever you pull any image it will show you here and the associate images and after when it pulled when you run it it will show you the complete compiled server here you can stop and you can start right the server right from here and you can also view the details logs and you can also see the files and you can also execute the commands so first of all how we start uh, how can we get the geo server image what is the command so in our geo server official website they have a very comprehensive guide for the docker image installation so let's start uh, okay let's open the command prompt and first of all run the command as they specified but uh, as per now the stable version is 2.25.1 so we will replace that 2.26 with the 2.25.1 so let's copy the command and replace the version with the stable release let's hit enter first of all it will look into the local container if it uh, if the command find the local container it will pull it right back i have the local uh, i have the image in my local so if you uh, using that command first time it will pull all the images from the internet it will take some time and after that it will show you the message like it is showing here okay after that we will run the geo server we will copy the second command first of all we can try that is our geo server is running or not and it's not so and in our docker we don't have geo server here so let's paste the command change the version and i will also change the port because I'm using ATAT on some other application. Let's run it. It will put together all the images uh, what uh, it has put from the internet, combine those images and of the combination of that it will run the container because a one container can have multiple images which is related to each other work with each other okay so it looks pretty good like it's working fine and the juice server has started let's give it a try and it's loaded okay let's log in, in and see what version do we have okay it's good now how can we install or include the extensions or plugin let's say do we have any extension we will have some CSS to configure and we will configure some monitoring plugin and if we are using SQL Server as our database for the geospatial data we also have the extension to configure our 
SQL Server with Geo Server. I have a separate video on that how to connect the Geo Server with the SQL Server or how to connect the S, uh, MongoDB with the Geo Server. I have a, a video on that. Uh, if you want to like to uh, share your views on that, please do comment on that. Okay, so we have our Geo Server up and running. Let's go for the extensions. Okay, okay, here we go. This is the command how you can install the extension. This is this line where you can define your extension these are the extension name which will you embed or add here so let's go and you can stop the user from here and you can also stop it from docker and it will stop from here too okay so let's copy the command I have the command in single line and here it is so the command is first of all docker run ray 80 80 and we have 80 81 code right so we will change 80 81 and install the extension through stable extension these two are stable extension we will replace these extension with our use extension like what we want to install here so we will delete these two and paste what we like to install here okay so this is our command docker and it on that port environment install extension stable extension these are the extension what we which we want to install okay let's give it a try and here we go so this command has some error so i have put some extra time in it and refine the command and here is the refine command so let's give it a try here we go now it will take some time to install the extension it will pull the extension from the geo server and will configure it into the docker geo server so let's uh, give it a time okay so our extensions are installed let's check it first okay we have monitor plugin we have vector tiles plugin we have sql server mongodb jadal and css and auth key okay if you want to see more about the authorization in geo server i have another video on that how to configure authorization key in your server please uh, go to it i will put the link in the description so let's have a look on our extensions first verifier we have a css extension installed and configured if yes then yes we will see a css in format okay now let's verify do we have sql server and mongodb configured and installed okay here we have a sql server and a mongodb if you want to see how to connect sql server or mongodb with a geo server i have another video on that both of the database and how to put the data in database and how to get it and how to configure those database with the geo server i will put the link in the description now we will verify the authorization key 
yes it is available okay so uh, if you want to see how many WFS and WMS queries or calls are uh, hit to the geo server you can monitor this by monitor plugin this is the WFS call and these are the WMS call okay so uh, we have one another extension installed which is vector tiles and this is in WMS came for the vector tiles extension here are topo json and this is the geojson vector tiles it looks similar to the geojson well let's get to the our last extension which is monitor we can see our daily call weekly monthly and we can also generate a, a report on it like these are the WMS calls and these are the WFS calls this is the comparison how many WFS calls are hit and how many WFS WFS calls are hit this is the single WFS call and this is the single WMS call and that is it and for the JDAL extension I have another video on that how to configure JDAL extension to Geo server please go and check it out and please if you like the video do subscribe my channel and like and share the video I will see you in my next video till then take care and goodbye